dead. <laughs> I got my outfit on. I look like The Rock from the 90s. Hi. I just woke up from a nap. I'm feeling refreshed. I've decided that YouTube is going to be my project. I know that I've made a couple videos before saying the same thing, but it's time to be serious because I want to do it. So I'm going to make some plans. And actually, crackety crack on. I'm on the phone. So I'm gonna go find out what's wrong and then work on getting better. Subscribe, ding. Uh, join me on this journey and we can learn together because I literally don't know what's going on and I am scared. So. I am 100% oversharing on the internet. Hopefully, maybe it'll help one person. That'd be cool. If not, it's just kind of a diary series and something to do to get my mind off of a feeling like garbage. That is the life update and on with the vlog. Hi, editing Lena here. Um, I didn't really explain what happened. Basically, I went to training for this work thing and then ended up having a really long episode uh, where I started getting seizures and I had to go to hospital. Um, I'm okay, uh, but I'm basically recovering and working on getting better. That's basically what I said in about 10,000 words. On with the show. Flashback. <sighs> I was going to film. A really nice like packing video or like getting yourself for training, but instead I'm crying in my car. This is gonna be a making yourself do things even when you don't want to do them vlog. Uh, we're building a self-discipline muscle and we're also exercising self-love. I'm gonna go buy some snacks, make myself feel better. The snacks is for this trip that I'm taking for work i'm gonna go training for a month up north there's some family stuff that goes on that i'm probably not gonna share online for a while i mean i might we'll see what the vibe is do i overshare to the internet maybe they do say take walks in nature and do things that'll make you feel better so as long as i don't run into anyone that i know I will feel somewhat okay, hopefully. So, I've bought a lot. I'm currently feeling really spaced out. It's because of what's happening. That means I've just gone kind of ham, spaced out, and just grabbed whatever. I normally don't like to go shopping when I feel like this because I do feel like I've completely zoned out and I don't know. I don't even know remember what I've bought so I'm gonna go check it out now and uh, probably go buy a bunch of random stuff that I fully didn't need um, so I'm just currently in the car park sorting my life out in the boot um, kind of aesthetically but there's a fucking seagull uh, there is a seagull hello you good yeah he's he's eyeing me up um, it's good to get attention sometimes. So what I've done so far, this is going to be the snack basket. I've decided to make my car into a Pinterest thing. So we've got crisps on that side, got some juice curtains, just some Rubicon. I like the Rubicon. Got some brunch bars, some cookies, some fruit roll-ups, and then underneath there's some cream eggs to deep down there. We've got some Kinder Buenos, some Kit Kats, and then I've still got a shit ton of snacks over here. Some more snacks, more snacks, more crisps. Um, I bought two Easter eggs. Um, I don't know why. And uh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to make a pancake video at some point. Look how cute this is. Yes. Um, this is gonna be the wellness box, sort of. So you got your deodorant, some hair, 
conditioners. Um, obviously, I've still got some cookies and stuff to put into this box. And then I've got my teas. Cookie teas are arguably the best teas ever. This one's because I'm ill, so I've got some lemon ginger honey tea. Hopefully, that'll sort me out. And then I've got my morning tea, my nighttime tea. You never know when you want tea. And then I've also got these kombuchas. I've got the peach one. I've had that before. I've had the raw berry one. I think I've had the mixed berry one before. But yeah, I'm going to sort that out and then do an update. So update. Little pasta little tea, little eel cup. It's got my name on it. My eel cup. Four to six days later. This porridge reminds me of my flat in London. Me and my flatmate, that looks disgusting. Me and my flatmate used to have this, what's it called, mama? Mama? This mama porridge every day. We'd either have the berry flavor or I think we had like pecan. And that was amazing. So, yeah. Miss you well, Puka. Feel new tea. I call this the morning tea. And then we have our nighttime tea. And I've also got this, um, I've also got this lemon, ginger, and honey tea because I'm sick. I need to shoot um, today this cover for our single that I'm doing with Maddie and Sean. Ow! Fuck my life. That burns. So. Gonna eat this up, put some makeup on, and shoot. I was gonna find a white wall, but every wall in this house is blue. Do you want a tall? This is where I'm staying for the next uh, at least week. This is the kitchen. Lovely. We got this set up over here, and I'm the first to arrive, so I got bedroom dips but this is the spare room bunk beds single bed lovely this is the other bathroom glorious and then obviously I've got my basket of snacks which is very needed so I've got the porridge got some chocolate got some bananas I don't know whose that is and we've got some grapes and then the best part. Oh, this freaking food. Oh yeah, and then hey, check my phone case. Case five. Um, obviously my room's a bit of a mess right now. The bathroom. Um, um, it's quite cute. It's got um this LED setup. Obviously, I'm gonna clean my room after. Had some food. Had a shower, if you couldn't tell. Steamy. Lovely. Day one. The porridge. Sad little porridge. I've added a single square of chocolate for cheekiness. I'm on my period. I deserve chocolate. That was nice. I'm still hungry. I do have a basket of snacks behind me. I'm so tired. Ah. Much, much, much later. Okay, please excuse this whole ensemble. But I have a couple updates. So since filming what you just saw, um, it's been two weeks and I have been mad struggling um basically i just had a fun breakdown i guess um i've not been very well recently and that's okay um 
blood. I'm figuring it out. Um, speaking to a professional because of how poorly I've been. I don't even know how much I would like to share on it. Probably not a lot at the minute. Um, so that is why my vlogs have been inconsistent because I've just been really unwell. So but I am excited because I'm get to use my new face product for the day. So this is the new cleanser that I bought. It is the Youth to the People Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamin Superfood Cleanser. It's the Youth to the People Green Tea Cleanser. Now, did I get it because Hiram said to get it? Yes. But he said that it's good for combination skin. And B, I have other combination skin, so. Hello? It smells nice. I would like that on my face. Okay. Now, I got like the travel size bottle, which is perfect because I'm currently traveling. Oh my gosh, it's, she's thick. With two C's. Oh, it smells like a smoothie. Oh, guy. Oh, gosh, that feels nice. That's a good cleanser. I like it. Oh, no, I dropped the lid. So, I've been using... What the heck have I been using? I think I've been using the CeraVe... Uh, I want to say sebum controller thingy. I don't know. I'll put it over there. Oh, look how glossy the face looks. So that's gonna excuse the lighting and literally everything about this inconsistent video. Oh, it's made my skin feel so smooth. That's a good cleanser. I got it from Cult Beauty. I got the mini one just to see if I liked it and I like it. We'll see how I feel after using it a couple of times. Alrighty then, that has been the end of the Road to Recovery series episode one um i hope you've enjoyed watching and now we are moving over to the puppy portion this is puppy chili having a great time jumping in some muddy puddles all part of the road to recovery is taking the doggy on some walks and going out into nature and having the bestest time ever so if you want to watch chili and her little puppy shenanigans like this right here look at that cheeky puppy then be sure to subscribe because a lot more puppy content is coming your way. But this has been Helena signing off for now. Thank you so much for watching The Road to Recovery episode one and I will see you in the next video. Bye.